My name is Imogen Sajet. I am a scientist. Isaac Imogen, private channel contact, do you copy? Read you clean and clear, Command. Status of your synth cores? I have been taught that history moves like the tide. A slow, inexorable movement. That the surf crashing on the beaches of time is an illusion. A momentary expression of change. The cores feel good. Quantum conduits green. It's their links with ship's power I'm less happy with. Are you calling Red? Right now, that surf threatens everything I have ever known. On any other day, I would. Did not catch that. Repeat, are you calling Red? Yesterday, my work made sense. I had a place that I earned. No intel, I'm not. Startup should even out irregularities. The synthetic hyperspace cores I designed were perfect. And I was to begin training a team of navigators. They were going to usher in a new age for my people, freeing us from reliance on ancient, unfathomable progenitor technology. Today, they are a means to an end. Today, I am being called into service as the only possible navigator of the Higaran mothership, Karkushan. Standby for mothership main sequence initialization. Here we go. Its sister ship, the Kar Sajuk, disappeared 20 years ago in a region of space known as the Anomaly. Along with our original hyperspace cores and my mentor, Karen Sajet. Only forward. Switching to open channels. And now, I alone am left to solve the equation. I am declaring launch enabled. Cautiously. I will be bound into the Karkashan, merged with the ship in both body and mind. Will I even still be me after the procedure? My boards match. I concur. Launch enabled. Power is internal. There is no more time for training. No more time for preparation. We've been ordered to launch. My entire life has been study, analysis, planning. Today, the galaxy is burning. My name is Imogen Sajet. I am Fleet Command. Intelligence Officer Paktu. Sir? Consider this briefing to be under the sunrise on Carrick protocols. There will be no more communication from Igara, and you are to remain calm silent until mission completion. Acknowledged. We are in the middle of an unfolding crisis. No matter what you may have heard, I assure you, it's worse. The following events occurred simultaneously across multiple major systems adjacent to the anomaly region. what happened to Karen and her fleet. Just that they disappeared, and the anomaly stopped spreading. Until now. We believe these events were deliberate attacks, and that they and the anomaly are linked. Hyperspace has been weaponized. Every simulation we've run, 
results in the total collapse of galactic civilization. This must be stopped. First, we need you to access Facility 315, where a prototype production module and supplies are in storage. We have traced the gate power flow to the Noctua 27 system, which appears to be the focus of the anomaly. You will make best speed to the Noctua 27 system. Is that understood? Understood. Until the protocols are lifted, nowhere is safe. Are you certain? Admiral out. Sir. Hmm. Confirmed, Agara. Sijin Sa, are you sure this is the optimal path? This ship is not ready. I'm not prepared. Imogen, the galaxy is not the laboratory. Karen knew this, and it allowed her to succeed where other Sajets might have failed. I'm not Lady Karen. You must see in yourself what countless others do. My precious granddaughter. Can you get us there? <sighs> yes. Generating initial nav equations now. <sighs> Hyperspace jump protocols initiated. Lowering damping bins. Funneling navigation construct to force. Course, spooling to speed. All hands, prepare for hyperspace jump. On my mark. Three. This is Fleet Command. Please come in. Does anyone read me? Sands and sinners, how did I get here? Your vitals are spiking, Command. Are you still mission capable? The jump, it... It wasn't what I anticipated. But the equation balanced out. You have that right. It was by the numbers. Numbers never lie. Hyperspace complete. The mothership is in position. Transmitting activation codes now. The mothership's assets are in stable hibernation. Status, green. The station recognizes the Karkushan. Initiating transfer. She's all yours, Engineering. Confirm, Command. Transfer protocols going smoothly. Tracking is good.
Intel, you may have spoken too soon. Capital class hyperspace signature detected. What they just did to that asteroid it shouldn't be possible. Mothership's production assets have been installed and are now operational. Engineering is working hard to integrate new production modules, but for now, current shipbuilding options remain limited. The Kalen Raiders we encountered are the last remnants of a Tidani vassal state, so it's no surprise that they still hate us, and that their carrier was an older, obsolete design. Obsolete or not? Hyperspacing through a solid object. That shouldn't be possible. How did they learn to do that? We have to assume the worst. That whoever is orchestrating the hyperspace attacks and the anomaly are outfitting and enhancing these raiders to stop us. We need to get to the Noctua 27 system as fast as possible. If we can access the Kessera Gate, I should be able to get us to our destination undetected. Optimal strategy command. Well done. And I was impressed to see you getting a handle on combat. You had me worried after that first encounter. I'm still struggling with it all. The losses. But I don't want to forget them. May the burden remain. Sorry? It's an old Pactu saying. Even in victory, there is loss. Forget that is to forget them. May the burden remain. May it remain. I'm plotting a course to cross the Great Boreal Sea in a single jump. Setting quantum waveform damping fins to maximum. Stand by. Hyperspace complete. 